Maddie and her older sister Holly sat at the dinner table eating supper with their parents as they did every evening. As seemed usual in their home Holly liked to dominate the conversation, telling their parents about her day at school and how well she was doing in every class. So mum today in biology Mr Hartford said I'm on track for one of the best marks he's seen on our individual coursework, oh that's great sweetie I'm really pleased for you, replied mum seemingly proud of her daughter and can you believe it in the childcare course they even had these massive baby dolls and they made us show that we knew how to change a nappy, I mean why do they need to teach us how to change nappies for God's sake, well you never know love it might come in handy one day. Maybe if you have children of your own, as Holly carried on and on Maddie found her boastfulness increasingly annoying, she had finally had enough and just couldn't help but say something. Jesus do you ever stop talking about yourself Holly I'm fed up with you going on and on about how amazing you are at everything, Maddie don't be so disrespectful and rude to your sister, all she's doing is telling us about her day, yeah Maddie what the hell is wrong with you are you you're jealous of me or something. That's right mum sighed with her of course she's too perfect to ever do anything wrong, stop being such an immature little brat Maddie, for God's sake, you're acting like a baby, replied mum angrily at her daughter's immaturity with that Maddie ran off up to her room in floods of tears, feeling utterly worthless and inferior at how her life was compared to her sister. Holly had always been seen by everyone as the perfect girl regularly achieving higher grades than Maddie and having a much larger group of friends thanks to her good looks and outgoing personality. But Maddie didn't see it this way, to her she saw Holly as boastful and full of herself, always going on about how she had done this or done that. Maddie felt fed up with living in her sister's shadow. After Maddie's little outburst, she had gone up to her room on her bed to sulk. Lying there, she felt angry at Holly's arrogant response and how mum had even defended her. These thoughts stirred in her mind as she laid there on her bed feeling worthless and upset, and soon, despite it only being 6.30pm she drifted off to sleep. She awoke a few hours later needing to pee, looking at the clock she was shocked to see it was now 2am and that she had slept through the whole evening. Due to it now being so late, everyone else had gone to bed. 